Hey guys, welcome to Minecraft with John. As promised, I'm in the exact same spot. I know this because I didn't move since I last recorded. So here's what we gotta do. This dirt has gotta go. One thing I do know is Jack's... Um... Staircase is like from right here. So... All this, so that's gonna have to get filled in with dirt. And I gotta make Gavin's house and Michael's house. And I gotta get Kung Fu on Ryan's house and figure out the height for it. Ray's house is basically done. Jeff's house still needs um, some work. Um, yeah. Okay. So, I hope you can hear me a little bit better now. I didn't realize the microphone was quiet down there, down my mouth. Urchid. So, let's start clearing some of this mess out. I need to take my little potion. I can move quickly. I could just hit the button really hard and fast in my bunch and get this done probably a little bit quicker, but not really worth it. Just I hold the button down and just kind of go. As long as the guys are moving blocks, that's what I'm after. Because blocks have got to be removed. I like as long as he doesn't stop or as long as I don't get too far away and miss blocks and stuff so what we're doing here is we're clearing out the area for Jack's house um, and I think I said last week in last week's video that we were going to or I, I'm sorry I I'm used to saying we uh, anyway I'll tell you about that in a second I said that I was going to give some dimensions that I got from watching uh, the building of Dark Achievement City. <clears throat> the Wii thing, though, I, I work for a large company. And a lot of times, you know, everything's a group effort. So it's. I don't, I don't ever phrase things as in, like, I did this for you, or I, blah, blah, blah. It's, it's always, like, we, the company, did it. And that's just like, kind of how I think about things, I guess. I'm probably like the weird one out. I think I'm probably the only one that does it. And it just feels right because, you know, I, I'm being paid by the company to do a service. So it's not like I'm not going to sit around and brag about what I did because that eh, shit is what they paid me to do. Not like it's that special. I like my job though, it's pretty fun. I do, I do pricing and cost analysis for a large trucking company. And seeing as how a guy that sits around and plays Minecraft watches Rooster Teeth and um, a lot of good stuff, plays video games and everything, um, I'm probably the type of person who would be a cost analyst. Otherwise known as a nerd. If you're offended by that, eh, whatever. I play video games. You play video games. It's all good. I assume you play video games. If you're watching this and you don't play video games, um, you're either trying to make fun of me or you have nothing to do today. So this is probably really boring. But hey, this is this is uh, the reality of it. <clears throat> I wanted to build it here. I could have faced my store in the center a different way, but one thing I did want to do is have um, you know when I'm here, I want it to kind of look like Achievement City, the real one. It's, there are obviously going to be a lot of differences, but uh, I thought one thing I could do was 
orient it in the same direction so the sky will look right. It won't, I won't have the sun at like an angle that I'm not used to seeing when I watch the Achievement Hunter videos. Because, you know, little stuff like that can throw you off. Okay, so... I've still got a good amount of land clearing to do. And some trees and stuff for Gavin and Michael's house. Michael's house goes, like, right here. And Gavin's house kind of wraps around that corner. So the land... Then i got to fill in some dirt here for Jack's house. And I need to see how tall uh, Ryan's house is. I don't know why I can't remember Ryan's name today. And it seems like it's too far back. It also doesn't seem like it's wide enough. But it's Kung Fu, a door, and then that. I want to think it's one wider, though. I need to go back and look at some videos again. I know for a fact the length and width of Jeff's house is right. Yeah, I need to look at Ryan's house one more time. I feel like it I feel like it should be one block wider. I know Ray's house is right. So I'm gonna do a little bit of a uh, tedious work behind the scenes. Um and then we'll be right back. And we're back. Things are coming along. Not not super quickly, but they're they're happening. Um I did have this one one off. Ryan's house was uh, was one two. I had it ending right here at six wide, and it's actually seven wide. So let's see if we can get. Oh, let's see if we can get Kung Fu up here. Kung Fu. My right R2 button is sticking. Right R2. Well, my right 2 button or R2 button is sticking. I know Kung Fu will fit right here. Oh, well, this is boring. Ah, oh, crap, there it was. If I put it right here, it would have worked. Shit. I had it and I hit the button again. Can you guys yell at me next time it comes up? I um, don't really need to make you watch this all again. So, we're going to pause. Come back when I have it. Hey, we're back. It still doesn't feel right. I need to go look at stuff again. I don't know. Something just doesn't feel right there. Anyway. Gavin's house. Gavin's house is a pain in the ass. I did have Ray's house too deep, by the way. Um, the best I can tell, it's six deep. I think. Oh yeah, I got Michael's house built. Um, I need to check on that height. I think it looks look, looks right. I don't know for sure, but that the house is right. It's seven by seven, um, 
two windows here, four sets of windows all the way around. I don't have the interior stuff done yet, but it's it's a house. Good enough for me. And the thing is cool is like as I step out here, it it's starting to feel like Achievement City, so it's starting to feel like I'm I'm watching one of the videos when I'm playing in it. That's that's pretty cool. That's a an interesting thing. Um because I'm not doing it in the same seed, it, there's going to be a lot of stuff I need to go back and fix. Like, after I get Gavin's house done, I'm going to bring this hill out to it. And I'm not going to show all that. That'll just take forever. So I get pictures on my phone here. I was just watching Plan G a minute ago. Obviously, you guys didn't see that. But I was watching Plan G and taking pictures on my phone. Gavin's stupid ass house. So there it goes. There's one, two, three. Uh, the Gavin's house pisses me off. It is they built it into a hillside, and it's just a. No, I don't cuss much in my videos, but building it out in the open like I'm doing is a clusterfuck. Yeah. Does it go back to? I think it does. The inside doesn't match the outside. It's just a, yeah, it goes back to past the window, which puts us right there. And then the hill comes up to it. Is that the back wall? You know what? I don't know. So it comes. See like right here. It goes bam, bam. And then here. It's just one. So. This is going to be a pain in the butt to figure out. Um, no, it's not. Uh, so, on this level here, it comes out one as well. I'm trying to figure out how tall this staircase thing he's got on it goes up. Yeah, it looks like what he did was this. So it makes it real steep. And so it starts from one behind the window. I'm pretty sure this is what he did. I've seen people recreate Gavin's house and you go have all the artwork in the right place and holy crap. Y'all saw how much trouble I had. Y'all didn't even see how much trouble I had getting Kung Fu on that. I went past it a couple more times just because I was mindlessly jamming the button. And it's starting to look like Gavin's house. Starting to, starting to. I don't know if there's, I think there's one more on top. That would make sense for there to be one more on top. Yeah, and it's built into a hillside, so I'm gonna, I'm going to have to extend a whole bunch of, basically, all this hill here is going to come up to it. That's gonna take me a few minutes, but you know, it'll be. It'll be essentially hollow, and then the inside of the house will be the wall of it, so. So, yep. Okay, so now. So, it looks like I come off of here. Actually, so let's just come up from here using the right brick. 
And if you're you're curious still, I'm using a uh, a picture I took on my phone, like I said a second ago. Is that right? Yeah, that's right. Um, just doesn't look it because that's not filled in. That is right. I I promise you it's right. I'm, like I said, I'm looking at a picture on my phone from Plan G, so that would be the the first. Uh, so there's three windows under that. The first time they showed this, it might have changed some since then. But I don't really care about the changes after that. This is not what this is about. Kind of just when I got into it, into the rooster teeth stuff. So let me come out two, let me come out three, and this one comes out. I should come out four, but I just want to be sure. It does. Okay, uh, there's that. Uh, works out perfect. All right, that's starting to look like Gavin's house. His pain in the ass house. Okay, so now on the one with the window, now we start getting picky about shit here. Um, yeah. I need a picture. I need a picture further over. Oh, there's a tree above his house with nothing under it. There it is. Okay, there's the whole house. So I was wrong. I was wrong. Okay. So we. Uh, I had found another picture. I took a little bit later. I was wrong about this. It's just flat up here. Like you got these wood house and like the square, square dirt, square like stone, and then Gavin's like. <laughs> I always thought recreating this would be a pain in the ass. It is. Just so you know. So is that three? One, two, three, yeah. So then the dirt behind it comes here. And yeah, I'm doing the stuff behind it, so. Which is really stupid. I shouldn't. But I am. Okay, so now, so we have one. So that's one, two, three. So two. Sorry, guys. I know this is probably ridiculous in terms of the boredom, but uh, it is what it is. So that. On top of this grass block, there's actually another one there. Maybe it comes out f four or something? Let's not worry about that. So we got the two. And then there's one set back and even further. And then we have that. All right, yeah, so. Um, 
looks like from about I really want to be sure on this so I'm going to go back to another picture to where it's clearer Gavin's house is a pain in the butt guys okay I'm going to pause the video and come back and uh, show you what I've done with Gavin's house because right now I'm not I'm not feeling it it's just not uh, it's not making me happy I'll probably have worked on Jack's house some too so we'll see in a second hey we're back again so I am not uh, super proud of my blending work here trying to make it kind of fit in with the mountain over there it does not look very good um, that's okay though hopefully as this gets grass and stuff on it it'll blend in more and not look horrible however from down here outside of this being different this I've got pretty much Gavin's house nailed um, it's really small inside smaller than I thought it was And this is it. You know, there's a secret door here, basically. And I've got a secret room. This would be way bigger than his Tower of Pimps room. But since I've kind of got this going on, I'm just going to utilize it. Might as well, right? It opens up over here to the outside. Oh, I'll have to close all that off. Close that off. It's just kind of open everywhere. Or I might just I might just close it right here, to be honest with you, just uh wall it in. I'll get to that later though. That's that's for another for another day. Um that's kinda cool that I do have. There's a hole right there I missed. That makes quite a difference. There's a cave. Keep the monsters at bay. Ah, uh, there's another cave. So things get things get uh, cavey real quick here. So yeah, okay. Right, more caves. There's caves all over. Anyway, um, again, keep the monsters, at monsters, the mobs, whatever you want to call them. Keep them, keep them away from us. Should be decent enough for now. So, uh, yeah, not not blended the best, not not near as well as uh, what I was hoping for. But it's fine. It's fine. It'll be it'll be all right with me. Yeah, Gavin's house wasn't very big. He had like bed here and a chest there, and then the artwork everywhere. But it's three here and two here. By however many of this is would pass the window, but you can see it pretty clearly what we got going on. It's just not very big. It's four four blocks high. That's it. And it pretty much has the right look. Uh on their seed the hill goes up further here you know it's closer but nah, I blended it in okay it's good enough is this getting grass yet not really Ugh. what I might do is like right here I might start tapering it back down cut off some of that so it doesn't look as bulbous I don't know I never can make stuff look as random as the real hills in the game. <sighs> I'm tired and yawning. Doesn't matter though. Doesn't matter at all because we got Gavin's house. Michael's house. And now for Jack's house. This dirt block here marks where his staircase would start. 
can jump back over to my pictures on my phone. Ended up getting a bunch of Jack's house, actually. That's Michael's. Michael's is like the Michael and Ray's house. Ray's old house. And Gavin's, I guess. Their door comes right up to the logo. But the other guy's houses, they sit back a bit. Where is it? It is raining. Yeah, so we got... Let's skip one. And do a wood block. And bam. Okay, so now I go back to my notes. I'm wonderfully entertaining, aren't I? Notes. Okay, Jack. Staircase start of corner. It is at the start of the corner. Uh, or it's supposed to be. See, I want to think it's like here, but that's the first block to start the corner this way. Anyway. Okay, so it's the start of the corner. Um, four back. I'll make sure I'm right. One, two, three. Four is the start of the house. Uh, I went up to deck. Deck is seven by three. So it's going to be one, two, three. So that's one. So I have So there's a seven by three deck on the front of the house. Um, take a seven by three. Total length is 12. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. 10, 11, 12. They'll make sure I know where the wall starts. glass all the way across the back or just the center section which we'll have to look at that in a second okay so now we go back to my photos glass all the way across the back okay now the front of it's kind of weird we have a door I can get a glass block and I can put it over my dirt and the glass goes up and around the door like that now on the side of the house one two three four five six seven eight uh, so we go back uh, I need a better picture I'm just grunting here it's not not good for vision So I'm having trouble figuring out where the side windows are on Jack's house. Those go all the way out to the sides. But we do have that and that. So, I have to work on that in a second. I don't know how tall that's going to be. So, it seems like it's going to be and the roof is 
<laughs> they did three across at the top. And then they one, two, three. How many steps are there? One, two. So there's four steps. That doesn't seem to work out. So one, two, three. Have I messed something up? Or did they do something funky? Funky to fry. Is the width right, guys? The width doesn't look right, but it's one, two, three. I can count it. I can see it. I'm looking at the picture. So I need to see here again. Hang on. We have. Uh, get this. We'll figure it out. So that's a step. Okay, and that's a step. Those two there. Oh no, there's just three. Okay, I was miscounting. Silly me. So the sign of it's what's killing me though. But I think I'm looking at it from the wrong. I think I'm approaching it incorrectly. There's the sign of it. So that's going to be two. So if I go to the back. And we're going to have glass. I think one, two. And then glass. And then one. And then glass. And then two. Yeah, that looks right. So how tall are those? Those are too tall. Too tall. Okay. This is the wrong way to do this, but it's happening. I guess it wasn't that bad. I don't have to clean up much. Okay. There's the sides. I am not going to do the lava in the ceiling. It poses too much risk. And I don't I don't really do the whole risk thing. Never want to know that, right? Okay. Really, his house could be two stories. Is that back window four tall? No, that back window is three tall from the floor. And then we have some good sensible wood across it. And that makes it not look silly when we have the roof. Okay. getting grass over there. It might not end up looking too bad. Maybe need to add some randomness to it and that's what I'll probably do. Just a block here and a block there. It's kind of weird out of place stuff. Try to hide that. Okay, does Jack's house have a window in the top and the back?
doesn't matter because the ceiling is right there so I'm not gonna put a window in the back of Jack's house Well, it could have one right there. Okay. Now, where are the stilts? I'll look up the stilt placement. And the stilts are made of oak wood. Because that's part of the house look. Need some fence, need fence. Where's fence? What am I doing? So, fence. What do you guys think? Should I cover this in obsidian afterwards? I kind of don't think so. So, I can mine this out. Uh, not yet, but we'll just do short stilts for now. It achieves the look. And that's what we're after, is the look. So there's one right here. We'll get that one on the other side. And if I do any, uh, one further up. If I do a little dig down, as they say, oh, there's one right here. Okay, so yeah, if I do turn this into a mine under his house, whatever I do, I will uh, extend the stilts down to. Cool, there's Jack's house. It even looks like it. Now, I can't encase it in obsidian and encase Gavin's in water. And yeah, yeah, I think. I think, I think, I think, if I do this right here, I don't like this, this is not pretty. You guys are getting to see my frustration here, I don't like this thing I did. And, I mean, it kind of makes sense, it's ugly as sin. My frustration is not very frustrated. Just kind of tired. Go to bed. My son's gonna be up at like 5:30 in the morning. I need to go to bed. That kid, he's almost one year old. He can play and play and play and play and play and wear himself out at least falling over and sleep and he can't keep his eyes open and oh it doesn't matter. It doesn't matter how tired he is. He is getting his ass up at like five thirty in the morning. Sometimes we can get him back to sleep for a bit. Uh, very often though, once he's up he's up. Okay. Do I still have dirt? I don't.
you guys kind of see what I'm doing here? I'm just kind of making that not as bulbous, I guess. I don't know if it's going to work how I want it to. Yeah, that's starting. That looks a bit more random and crappy. That's what we're going for. Random and crappy. thing off here. Uh, we'll end right here. I'm hardly talking, I apologize. Just trying to get this to look somewhat like dirt. Like it's actually a mountainside. And not made by me or hiding something or that whole thing. spot I'm after. Okay. So that's all sealed off. It looks like shit. Kind of more random like a normal hillside should be. Uh, let's cut that one off and that one off. And then also cut that. Not cut that. Yeah, cut that. And we'll build it back up from the inside. There we go. Okay. That looks way better. That looks more like a hill, especially once it gets grass on it. That looks better, better, better. I don't like that one. Let's get rid of that. There we go. I like that look. Okay. Um... Ray's house, which it's too long. Yeah. Let's get rid of this back wall here. Fill this in just up to the level. Okay. There's Ray's house proper, proper size. Looks a little little square there. Kung Fu house, 
which is Ryan's, Jack's, Michael's, Gavin's, and Hillside, which took way more work than it should have. The Achievement Hunter logo. There we go, guys. I mean, I've still got to build Jeff's monolith. I'm not going to build it that tall. That's dumb. I'm going to build it this tall. So, eh, inaccurate. I don't care. It'll be up above the clouds. When you go inside, you'll be able to see a cloud inside of it. I'm not going to build a leaky ceiling. But you got to look at the time you put into it, too. I've spent way too much time on Gavin's house. And it'll still be a huge monolith. And it'll look it'll look more like it did. Um, you know what? <clears throat> it'll look more like it did in um in the Xbox three sixty version. That's what I'm trying to say. I knew there was a word there I was after. Because in the Xbox 360, or at least the original version, before the updates, you couldn't um, build very high. You can build a lot higher than you could now. You can build a lot higher now than you could then. See, as I get tired, I'm losing it. I probably could have gotten rid of all this by now, but I was getting bored doing that. I'm going to set this off from the bottom so hopefully it doesn't blow anything downwards. And hopefully that gets rid of all of that. <laughs> it didn't. There it is. Better explosion. Well, crap. Let's just do this. Yay. All right. So, Jeff's house will be this tall. Because this is a perfectly accurate achievement city. It's just an approximation. Then I'll have to build a subway system to connect to my subway terminal. And you guys will get to see that, I'm sure. Oh, yay, hooray, everyone wants to see my subway terminal. Still got more work to do. There's gonna be some other things from Achievement City I want to build. I wouldn't mind building a copy of their uh, Pac-Man game. Maybe Creeper Soccer. Creeper Soccer was smaller. This is the quickest way I found to do this. As you can see, I'm leaving a gap here. Um, you just go up and down, up and down, up and down as quick as you can. And then you, when you get done, you just go back and fill in that gap, which is pretty easy and quick to do. So I did something cool. Um, slime blocks were added. And uh, I thought, hey, slime blocks make a really cool way to get into stuff in survival mode without hurting yourself. So we're going to go over here to my um, 
a subway and this is the this is the um skylight thing that comes up out of the out of the big tower of pimps but there's a hole all the way down here and it's just a quick way to get in you just fall down and you land on a block of slime which bounces you and then you don't get hurt but yeah this is essentially my uh, cheater way of showing off my subway terminal because I'm very proud of this gigantic underground room I made down here at the bedrock um, if you put this game in hard mode holy crap you can get like 60 slime it's insane I have a video of that actually check this out here That was a bunch of slime, right? That was crazy. Okay, so now we go back up to the surface, and I think we'll call this video, call this video at an end. But what we're first going to do is fly back over to Achievement City. What's here of Achievement City so far? Just check it out. We got Gavin's house. We got Ray's old house before Ray went to do Twitch. Uh, we get Kung Fu House, which became Ryan's house, Jack's house, Michael's house, and uh, the the uh, startings of Jeff's house here, and then the logo. So that's pretty cool. Just a little something to add to my world. All right, guys. I hope you enjoyed it. Come back uh, for more. I don't really know what I'm going to build next. I keep getting. Well, one, I keep getting sidetracked now. Say I'm going to stop talking and I keep talking, but I keep thinking that I'm going to build something and this certain thing and that certain thing, and then I don't, and then I kind of randomly get like an inspiration like, oh yeah, I want to build, I want to build a wipeout course, or I want to build something I saw somewhere. And then I just like focus on it so hard and do it and get it done. But then I'm like, oh, I don't know what I want to build. And I'll just wander around in the game. Just kind of aimlessly looking for something to do. And I'll kind of stop playing it. And then kind of go on my way. And then something else will have me like, oh, I want to build that. So I'll figure out what I need to do to build it. And get kind of mapped out in my head. And then go in and build it. And then I'll play the game for a while. And then I kind of wander around aimlessly. Then I kind of get bored with it. And that's what's been happening in Minecraft with me. I just kind of keep, I keep getting kind of bored with it and just keep coming back because I can just build whatever I want. Okay, guys. I hope you enjoyed it. Uh, it was fun. It's awesome building Achievement City. It's cool getting to watch those guys. It kind of got me into Minecraft and into making these videos. And that doesn't go there. So, yeah. Come back. Uh, like, subscribe. Come back for more.